What have you been putting off? Think about it. Lao Tzu once said that the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. So many people are afraid to take that step. My question for you is if I went to the darkest corners of your brain, the darkest corners of your memory, and, and, and tried to discover what is it that you're so passionate about, something that you love more than anything else, but for whatever reason, you can't figure out that first step, so there is no action, right? You're only in your head. I would ask you, what is that one little thing you can do? Is it, could it be just as simple as saying to someone, I'm gonna start? right? It could be that action. It could just be writing a plan for the first time. It could be doing what many of my friends have talked about for years. We talk about Foucault, which is you get so caught up in the how, you might be able to figure that one out. I know that sounds horrible. Please take it the right way. Sometimes you got to let go of the how and just get into action, right? Is it making phone calls? Is it meeting the right people? Is it declaring to your friends, I'm committed to this? Life is really short. I think of one of my friends, we were sitting one day, the Holiday Inn in Irvine having lunch. We were doing a workshop there and his phone rang and it was his mother and his mother said, your father just died. Your dad just died. And I remember running up to his room, grabbing all the stuff, throwing him on an airplane, sending him back to Chicago. And he called me the day before the funeral. And it was just like this extraordinary moment because we were just like, how do you, how do you say to someone who's having this kind of life experience, like, how to be present in that moment and, and do the right thing and honor your dad, right? That was the a thousand mile journey for him, right? Even though it was just a day. And we talked about just knowing what to say and we wrote out a little script. And you know what was remarkable about that, about that story? He called me afterwards and he said, you know, Tom, he said, there must've been 800 people at the funeral. And every person walked up and said, you know, your dad, Ron, was this to me. He, he was a mentor, he was a friend, he, he caught me at my, at my worst moment and he lifted me up. He, you know, I was a drinker and he got me to stop drinking. He helped me start my first business. He was the coach of the Little League team. He said every single person had like this extraordinary story about my dad. He said not one of them said he was the number one life insurance salesperson in the country, which he was for 15 straight years. They all identified him as a person that helped them make that first step. Maybe, just maybe, you need someone like that. Maybe, just maybe, you need to reach out to someone like that and say, I've had this crazy dream, this thing that I've wanted to do forever, but I'm just stuck in my head and I wanna start, but I don't know where to start. The how is always easy, my friend. It's just making the decision and getting into action. Who do you need to call today? What do you need to do today? Because that thousand mile journey is begging you to start.